All right, so this video we're going to look at finding the mean of a frequency distribution or group distribution. All right, so the, the mean, the sample mean of a frequency distribution is x bar is equal to the sum of f times x, that's the frequency times the x values, over n, where n is the sum of the frequencies. Okay, so let's come over here and look at our example. All right, so here we have a frequency distribution. We have the IQ scores, okay, and we have the frequency. So this right here means that there's two people in the group that had an IQ score between 50 and 69. 33 people had an IQ score between 70 and 89, and so on. All right, so if you remember from our formula, we need the sum of f times x over n, okay? All right, so f, that's the frequencies, all right? x, x, let me erase this so I can get some room here, x is your midpoint of each one of your intervals, okay? So remember to find the midpoint. So let's find the midpoint of the first interval. So to find the midpoint, you add the lower and upper limits together and divide by two. So 50 plus 69 divided by two, that is 59.5. And then we'll do the same for the other one, 70 plus 89 divided by 2, that is 79.5. And then 90 plus 109 divided by 2 is 99.5. And then 110 plus 129 divided by 2 is 119.5. And then 130 plus 149 divided by 2 is 139.5. So that's the midpoints. Okay. Now, what am I going to sum up? I'm going to sum up f times x. So I have to multiply this value and this value together. And then I have to multiply this value and this value together. And so on. Okay, all the way down. So I'm going to have me an x times f column. Okay, so I've got 2, 2 times 59.5. That's going to give me 119. Then I have 33 times 79.5. And that's 2,623.5 and then I have 35 times 99.5 so that's 3,482.5 and then I have 7 times 119.5 that's 836.5 and then I have 1 times 139.5 which is 139.5 all right so now let's get our n value and our sum of fx so n is equal to the sum of this column so I'll add the 2 plus 33 plus 35 plus 7 plus 1 so 2 plus 33 plus 35 plus 7 plus 1 and that gives me 78 so that's n that's the sum of the f column now I need the sum of f times x so that means to sum this column so I've got 119 plus 2,623.5 plus 3,482.5 plus 
136.5 plus 139.5 and that gives me 7201 alright so now the mean the sample mean is the sum of the f times x values over n which is 7201 over 78 so let's see what we get there we get 92 point and I'm gonna round it to two decimal places 0.32 all the decimals is 92.32051282 and that's how you find the mean of a frequency distribution all right so I hope this helped uh, give me a like share subscribe and thanks for watching